first eco verbatim what chairman said. See, the most important thing, we need to grow and we cannot be constrained in terms of the growth. If we want to be a developed nation by 2047, we need to grow 12 to 15% every year. And let's not forget that we cannot compromise the growth. As therefore, the entire growth has to be the green growth. That's very important. You know, that's point number one. Let's also not forget that, well, some of the states like UP has to grow 20% annually in order for, for, for India to grow 2047 to be developed nation. That's what is the target. And similarly, you know, the power requirement by the time in 2047 will go to <coughs> 40 legs of, you know, the uh, megawatt. That's the energy thing that we are talking about. So therefore, the stay with the requirement of the economy and economy must grow. That's point number one. Point number two, how do we grow? And therefore, the growth we are talked about, the green growth we are talked about, solar, renewables, and everything. But that point is very well taken, of course, that's growing very well. We're talking about solar and the hydrogen and all. But the point is that these two, or the vertical integration will be most important thing. You grow the solar energy, then you need to produce the green hydrogen that you need to produce. You need to produce the ammonia. Then you need to produce, you know, uses of the ammonia. But let's not forget that we did talk about a great deal about the, uh, the storage problem of the, of the hydrogen. See, the, some of the studies which have been done abroad and the storage you know, technology that's being developed by different institutions, including the IIT Kanpur. Well, simplest thing is ammonia itself is a carrier of hydrogen. Ammonia itself will give you the energy. Ammonia itself will you not only think use ammonia in the fertilizer, ammonia, ammonia is definitely a storage for, for hydrogen. And that's what's being talked about for point number two. The green hydrogen, the green ammonia will be of massive help. But what is the requirement is a, is a vertical integration. You know, you don't want to, you know, as far as possible, you don't want to produce something A plus something at place A, something at B, and something at C. And then in the process of, you know, integrating that thing from different locations far distant, you have its own carbon footprint, which might be even bigger than having gone the green. So that is what is the thing, then overall analysis, overall integration, that has to be kept in the point, uh, kept, has to, uh, kept has to be, we have to keep that in mind.